Uh, first of all, I'd like to congratulate these guys for the three years of hard work that they put in, four, actually, four years of hard work they put in representing Chester High School. There's no doubt in my mind when they leave us, they will represent us in the same fashion. Um, a lot of people dream about having an opportunity to play college football and get an opportunity to get away from home, and I think both these guys are definitely going to get that, going you know, opposite end of the world. But um, John's had a, a kind of glorified senior year, making all state, all area, region player of the year, um, being named to a lot of different teams along with all star game. Quay's had a Unbelievable two years. Uh, he's been all region, all area, one of the top DBs in the state. And uh, both of these guys deserve everything they get. And we're very proud of them as a staff. And we're just excited about where they're headed. Now, no further ado, I'll allow those young men to tell you exactly what they'll be attending school next year. Right, uh, with Quay Hart now, he's headed to Independence Community College in Kansas. First of all, congratulations. Thank you. Uh, tell me about how you ended up there. What played into your decision to choose Independence? I had to get my graduate, so I had to go there. Have you had a chance to go visit you? Yes, sir. What did you did you did you like the area and the, the, yes, the school and the team and everything? Um, you're a guy who played a lot of positions: wide receiver, played defensive back, big time kick returner. What did they see you as? Oh, they told me they were gonna let me try out both. See which one I like. Do you have a favorite? No, yes, sir. Just just wherever they want to play, he's fine with you. What do they like about your game? Ball hawk. I like to attack the ball. That's, uh, I think you were, what, second in the state? Mm -hmm. As a junior with what, eight interceptions? I had nine. Nine interceptions. Uh, people didn't throw, throw at you much last year, did they? Yes, sir. But uh, still had a huge year, I mean, as a lockdown corner and as a, a receiver. Um, what is it that you like about the game of football? Because you play other sports, too. Why did you? And probably could have you know, perhaps played a different sport in college. What is it about football that, that makes it your favorite sport and maybe the one you wanted to pursue in college? Because I like catching touchdowns and intercepting repeats. With uh, John Irby, first of all, congratulations. Thank you. Uh, tell me how you ended up at Rhode Island University. Um, Coach Varner, he was at East Carolina University and he was scouting me there and he got a job from Rhode Island. And he wanted to offer me as soon as he got there. So that's how I ended up there. Okay. Um, what about Rhode Island appealed to you? Um, the location. I actually like the distance. You know, the, it's in Kingston, Rhode Island. That's a really nice uh, town, city type thing. And uh, the football program is really good. And I really like the people up there and all the coaches up there. Um, you were a, a pretty versatile guy here, uh, both in terms of how many sports you played. I mean, you would uh, run them all off for me, uh, football, uh, football, track, I didn't soccer, play basketball. golf. Track, <laughs> soccer, and golf, yeah. Um, but you were also versatile on the football field, quarterback, receiver, uh, punter, kicker. What do they see you as? They see me as – they they saw me as a receiver. So – but it's got me like kind of as an athlete position, so I'll be moving around on offense. Is that your favorite position to play? Receiver, yes, sir. Okay. Um, you mentioned that your grandmother had never gone to a football game until she never, saw you play. Never. She what, decided, what, what did she think of the game and and how well you might have done that night? She loved it. Like, no matter how I played, she just she loved seeing her grandson. So I guess this is her first football scholarship signing ceremony too. Yeah. Right? Yes, sir.